Donald Trump's approval rating in the state of Alabama is 80 percent. That's Donald Trump running against the ghost of Hillary Clinton, the mainstream media, the, you know, uh, academia. The second you have a flesh and blood hatreds. conservative running against him, if Mike Pence were to challenge him in the primary, or if Jeff Flake were to challenge him, suddenly people are like, oh, wait a second, we don't have to have somebody that acts crazy right. in the White House that actually is a, is a hardcore conservative. And we can vote for him. But you're jumping you know, pretty far ahead in time, yeah. and we're going to have an election next year. And the simple fact of the matter is, if he's got 80% in Alabama, it's not like a Democrat is going to win, you know, the Senate in Alabama. I mean, there, you right. know, there is actually a senatorial race in Alabama, and no Democrat is going to win that now right. or in 2018. That's not the issue. The plain political issue is Democrats need 24 House seats to take the House back in 2018, and the, ta the table is being set pretty nicely for them to get that number. And if they get that number, or 10 more than that number, he's going to get impeached. Yeah, he, I'm not saying he's going to be convicted and thrown out of office. I'm saying that the House oh, he will, be will impeached. impeach him if, they ha if Democrats have a 10-seat majority. And if he doesn't right the ship, he's writing his own, you know, uh, he, he's Clinton in 1998 and 1999 with no recovery possible. Yeah. Clinton was doing that at a time of explosive economic growth. Steve,